guess who's in town in Manila, Pordy, Michelle D. Antonia Porzo, this Universe Thailand, this Universe First on Rock. They are together. I'm gonna go and see them now. Exciting, no? Let's see what they have to say. The fans have been waiting for this for so long. A lot of collaborations, a lot of projects, a lot of milestones to hit, a lot of things to launch. I wish I could be. No time is the most valuable resource that you can ever take back, stop, or replace. I try to take every day as if it were my last. But yeah, I'm you just keep um, so by by the running journey. Though I am always grateful for all of the support that you have given me, and of course Antonia as well. And I hope that this isn't the last. It's really a, it's a, a genuine friendship. it's a genuine friendship, but of course our friendship will last as long as it it will because we it's are genuine, just genuine friends. I mean, you don't <laughs> you don't want to assume that the friendship is going to end because if anything, you know, in the world of pageantry, you really do find your other sisters that you connect with the most. It's quite impossible to become close to all of the delegates, but you also find lifelong friends yes within and those you're lucky weeks. if you can't find those mm -hmm. people and when you do you should cherish them no matter how far they are keep in contact and always love them the same as long as we continue to represent that then then we'll always be here <laughs> the whole hashtag 40 was really birthed it was really formed because we wanted to represent unity between Thailand and the Philippines. And I'm so glad that that's what we represent. Something that is actually a genuine friendship actually represents the unity of two nations. Since the whole party thing happened, I'm just so glad that we represent something so amazing, especially because it's not fake. And uh, I just want everybody to know that Antonia is such an amazing person. She is so genuine. She really thinks about other people first. And that's the kind of people that you want to surround yourself with. What I admire most about Michelle is that she is someone who is, and I, and I brought this up earlier as well, that she is someone who is not afraid to be who she is and be her true authentic self, which is something that is really hard to find, especially in the beauty queen in this industry. And during our time together in El Salvador and in Mexico, I feel like our bond really got stronger because even though it was a competition, we still had each other's backs. We still supported each other and uplifted each other throughout the entire time there. And I don't think that my journey in this universe would have been the same if you were not there to be by my side and to give me a realistic perspective outside of all the glitz and the glam. But it's always good to have that one friend that is you know that you don't have to be someone else when you're with them. And I'm so grateful for our friendship, that's what we created, of course, the Pordy family. Just watching your journey grow from what you've told me until today has been so inspiring and I know that you will continue to inspire so many more people in the best way possible with your strength and your authenticity and your kindness. <laughs> okay, so here we are, 40 in the flesh in the Philippines. I mean, I live here, but yes, welcome, Antonia. Thank you. I'm so happy to be here. It was such a treat for the fans to see you. Of course, me too, right? Antonio is here for even like less than 48 yeah. hours. Yeah. Is that because you're. Why don't you stay a little longer? You have She's work busy. Well. She's I would love to stay for much longer, but unfortunately, I have work. Um, so the schedule was very tight this time, but for sure I will be back soon and you guys won't be disappointed with 
what you got up to today? First 24 hours so far, how would you rate it here in the Philippines? Uh, splendid. <laughs> Very eventful. 100 out of 100. 12 hours filled with so many things to do. <laughs> yeah, but the adrenaline is just keeping you going, I guess. Yeah. You know, everything has like, the show always does. There's always a silver lining. It's just about which mindset you choose to, to use and see things from a better how, how unimaginable that candidates in this universe after it's done, you're, you're still like super connected and super close. So it is possible, as even from rival countries. And these, uh, how did you guys do it? Unintentional or? Definitely uh, the intention was to unite Thailand and And uh, that's what our intention was. That's still what we want to represent but of course behind all of that is such a genuine friendship and uh, honestly it is possible as long as you I mean as long as you have good intentions that any relationship can be yeah Antonia um, is this something that you would recommend to other candidates like you know like you were saying to have a higher purpose like only one person can be the crown to have good intentions but the friendship is like I mean everybody talks about this so it's all but you know in the end it is a once in a Definitely not, baby. It's just, it's not 